Jumbo Mumbo, familia Angu. Uh, welcome to my home. Uh, Karibu ni umbani kuangu. Uh, my name is Eli. Uh, mimi ni Eli. Uh, Kaneli yangu ni Eli B. Eli. Uh, my channel is called Eli B. Eli. Uh, welcome to my well, welcome to my channel. And if you haven't liked and subscribed, please like this video and subscribe to my channel. I have some really good news before I talk about what I uh, the topic at hand. But guess what, folks? You're looking at somebody who is on the very verge of going three digits. Uh, at last count, my uh, subscribers are 99, and, uh, you know, uh, I'm very happy about that. Allahu Akbar, alhamdulillah, I'll have more. You know, it's a, it's a nice thing. To those who are celebrating Ramadan, uh, I want to wish you a Ramadan Karim, Ramadan Mubarak. Uh, to those who are celebrating Sabbath, you know, I want to wish you uh, Shabbat Shalom. Uh, anyway, uh, what I have to talk about today, oh, and uh, Habari, I hope everything is going well for you. And, uh, you know, it's like I'm, I'm in a good mood. I'm in a good place. You know, uh, may Allah be praised. You know, and uh, I thought of something really, really funny today. I saw it. And... I just sat there, I sat there and, and I had to smile. My yoga no who uh the redima of Nabohanzit, the redima of Tanzania and the redima of Nairobi who can barely get out a sentence uh my you know who has killed the dragon kill the wall, drink dragon blood, uh, ride unicorn everywhere, everywhere, German. Uh, <laughs> 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 My Yugano has taken it upon himself. <laughs> this is funny. My Yugano has taken it upon himself to teach my popo how to speak English. <laughs> yes, you heard it correctly. <laughs> my Yugano has become an English teacher. <laughs> <laughs> I hope that poor kid never sees any of these videos. He's going to think I hate him. But he's funny. My Yugano, the Redima of Nabohanzit, the Redima of Hispania, is now English teacher to Mapopo. First, of course, he's trying to learn English himself. <laughs> they just showed a, a video of Mayugno being incredibly happy, surrounded by his sidekicks, by his henchmen, and they're running around a piece of land, you know, boasting about how this, uh, he just got this piece of land and everything. Uh, I, I, you know, I saw something that was really brilliant. I I watched a video in which Mama Ann's house was designed. And guess who the architect of that house was? It was my Yugano. He asked for a piece of paper and a pen, and he basically drew out that house and how it was going to look. And, you know, he did a pretty good job. Now, some people would say that there are, are problems with that house, but at the same time, you know, you got to give him credit for something. Anyway, I am laughing my head off about what's going on with uh, iVentures. 
and uh, our dear, dear friend Marwa. You know, uh, apparently, you know, I, I, I don't know if all, any of you are old enough to remember a film called Gremlin. A uh, gremlin is a, a obnoxious little creature that you invite into your house and it eats everything and it ends up tearing up your home. It ends up running you out of your own home. This pretty much describes what's going on with Adventure and uh, Marwa. You know, Marwa is basically being a royal pain in the behind. He constantly whines, constantly complains, complains about American food, complains has even gone so far as to suggest that this man hire a maid, never mind the fact that he's there acting like if he's, again, the king of Nabohansit. The king of Nabohansit doesn't do any work. All that he does is he walks around with his camera. And uh, I, I forget the name of the cousin, but I venture has a cousin who's living with him. And he's pretty much turned his cousin into a servant. He's bossing him around, telling him what to do, telling him what not to do. And generally is uh, doing the typical Marwa thing, making a pain of the, in the behind of himself and driving everybody crazy. The way that I, I think his name is Donovan or something to that effect. I don't know. I'm, let me not get the name wrong. My theory is that that guy who he's turning into a servant is going to lose it, and it's going to go bow on, uh, on Mara and beat his behind. And nobody will be surprised if it happens. Anyway, uh, the other thing that I saw today on the internet that was kind of funny, Davey has chosen, you know, they say that, uh, well, what's, what's the saying about, you know, uh, uh, a brave man flees and runs and lives to fight another day? Davey has decided to completely duck out on this uh, mess that his uncle has gotten himself into and uh, has uh, decided to flee to flee the kingdom of Isbania and run back to somewhere for a couple of days or whatever. And, uh, you know, whatever you say about Davey and his uncle, even if he's exploiting his uncle, there's a, a genuine sense of love in between those two guys. They're, in fact, if you look at them, you begin to realize it. At a certain level, these guys are in, uh, inseparable. They they have an attachment for each other. And I, I you know, as as much as I think that Davey is in fact something of a scammer, you know, uh, at the same time, that's a part of him that I respect. That. Even if he is using his uncle, he has a fundamental love for him and, uh, you know, is doing his best by his uncle in his own crazy way. You know, and apparently Mo has returned to his senses, but uh, all the people that he disrespected and threw under the bus and accused of all kinds of things, I don't think you're ever, I don't think that that, that man is, is capable of making an apology or acknowledging that he was wrong people who are basically in his corner and who have treated him kindly. But anyway, that's all that I have to share. Once again, if you haven't liked this video so far, please take a moment and, and, and like it. I, I'm at 99. My theory is that by the end of the weekend, I'll be past 100 members. And this is wonderful. This is all in the space of uh, about a month. You know, so I'm I'm very, very happy, you know, uh, but at the same time, you know, I, I, all the credit is due to you folks who have been willing to subscribe to me. And if there's anybody else out there who's, you know, gotten a little fun out of watching my videos, please subscribe to me. And I'll tell a friend to tell a friend, have a great and wonderful weekend. And uh, until uh, tomorrow evening. You know, uh, thank you very much. Uh, you know, you don't know how, you don't know how it makes me feel. You know, seeing uh, having anybody subscribe to me, I think you people are wonderful. Thank you, and have a good evening or a good morning.